What's up, y'all? Trucker's life, and I'm back, baby. Put out the 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 the, the black diamond watch. Had to pull these motherfuckers out, baby. I know y'all see a lot of videos with this one and my white and yellow gold one. I'm gonna start pulling out my other watches on y'all. They're not as as blingy and shiny as this one as y'all see. That's all diamonds, y'all. Not trying to flex, but hey, I'm proud of what I can afford. You know what I mean? And to be honest, I didn't really pay that much for this. I won this in a raffle. And yes, I had a diamond tested before I actually showed it. But what I'm doing right now is I'm de the shrimp. Already got my rice going. Y'all didn't see me cook rice enough. I don't need to keep showing y'all the same shit. So, I'm gonna do this. We'll grab another bowl right here. Yeah, I keep these in my truck too. I gotta buy some more soon. I don't use them that much, so I don't buy them that much. But, uh, y'all will see what we're doing. It's gonna be a quick video tonight. It's not gonna be that long. So y'all, hey, I'm telling y'all, man, I'm not, I'm, close to just giving up on YouTube to be honest because I give a couple of views per video I might get like five or six views per video in a week that ain't right because I woke up this morning in Salt Lake City I'm in Riverside California Google how many miles that is and that'll give you the ballpark of what I did today because I already I woke up this morning in Salt Lake City, and then I uh, got a call about an hour before I got to our, to our yard in Harupa Valley, and what I did, they called me to ask me, so, because I got to get my medical card renewed tomorrow, so, they called me, I was like, would you be willing to drop your load tonight? Hell yeah, I need to get my medical card renewed. Cause they was trying to they was trying to fuck with me. You feel me? Like, nah, I stayed on their ass today. Because they tried to give me a load to Phoenix and told me, oh, we'll get your uh physical done when you get back in town. Nah, that ain't happening. So I took it above the ass. And if my fleet manager see this, I don't care. I've been doing this job long enough to where, hey, y'all don't like how I am, fire me. I'll be with somebody else tomorrow. Somebody else that appreciate the miles I put up. Because just today alone, it was like, it was only like, well, I say only, but to normal people, that's not a lot of, that's a lot of miles, but to us, 620 miles is it's a light day I know drivers that put up 800 but they don't run legally I run mine electronic logs our company not only we like electronic logs but our trucks are governed at 65 and I did mountain terrain today I did all that I'm gonna download another video I took the other day about why you should stay off your phone yes I picked up my phone in the middle of the video to show y'all the repercussions of texting while you're driving and y'all will see it probably before this one loads because this is gonna be a longer video than that one But y'all know me. I don't give a fuck. And shout out to my favorite person alive right now. My babies. My favorite people alive, I should say. My two beautiful daughters. Desiree and Janaya. You guys haven't met Desiree. She's 19, so she'll be out doing her own thing. But she's still, she's still my baby. She is 
who taught me how to be a dad. She's who taught me what unconditional love is. You know what I mean? Sorry, I'm trying to make sure. Taking the shells off of all these. And there's a good reason I did check, because there's one I didn't take the shell off of. But I'll be honest with y'all, hey. When I get my hotel, I devote that to Janiah. I don't want y'all to think, oh, he, on the weekends he just disappears. Yeah, I do. Because I'm with my baby. She deserves my attention undivided. And I don't... I don't like to... Bring her out of her element. Because she is the kind of person who... She's like me. We like structure. We like schedule. And when she's with me, that's what she's used to. You get what I'm saying? Like... That's my baby. When she said, Dada... I ask her, I'm like, Naya, you want to record for the channel? She's like, Dad, I just want to cuddle. Okay, Dad, you cuddle then. YouTube comes after her. Yes, I know. I'm I'm growing very slow. Now I'm putting in the work, but y'all ain't putting in the work. I need y'all to put in the work. But I still love the ones that rock with me. You feel me? And shout out to Jesse Holly, man. He, that's my guy right there, Jesse Holly. I don't physically or personally know him, but I've followed his journey. I used to watch Fourth and Long on TV. If y'all remember that show with Michael Irvin, I called in the Hanging with the Boys the other day, the best show on Cowboys Network. She's like a shameless plug. But yeah, he, uh, as soon as he heard my name, he knew exactly who I was, which is humbling. You know what I mean? He flat out said on there, oh, that's the truck that cooks, that's the guy that cooks in this truck. That's me. As y'all see, that's what I'm doing right now. But the rice is done, so I'm going to unplug this rice. Put a plug down there and grab my steam tray. The first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put the shrimp up here. Let it sit there for a minute. I'm gonna put this these shells in here. Because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the shells in there. And then I am going to plug that in, turn it on, and it's simple, this ingredient is so simple, y'all, I'm gonna grab my butter knife, yeah, I know y'all saw the, this is dehydrated red onion, there we go, that's good right there, grab some soy sauce, go grab the minced onion I mean garlic I mean god damn I have a slippery there we go sorry when you go from Utah to back to California it kind of pressurizes everything again here's a knife here's a knife there we go Then of course we're gonna get the butter. This is a simple little sauce. It's an Asian inspired sauce, of course. But this ain't the only part. You gotta put a lot of butter in this. 
because you also got to put the butter into the rice. There we go. That's good right there. But yeah, y'all, while I'm doing this, I'll talk to y'all for, for a sec. But yeah, I woke up this morning in Salt Lake City. I am in Riverside, California, in Southern California. Maybe like 90 miles from fucking San Diego. I'm tired as hell. There it is. That's what I was looking for. Oh. What did you say? Oh, this is my habanero powder. It been rubbed off. Sorry, it says chilies. But this is my habanero powder. There we go. Just a little bit. I don't want to blow my mouth open again. Made that mistake too many times already. And I'll grab the lid. Let it do what it do. And I'll be back, y'all. Alright, y'all, I'm back. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna find this right here and take the shells up. That's what I was using to season the butter. So I'm taking all the shrimp shells out because they're it will season the butter plenty. I'm hungry in other words. I woke up this morning in Utah. I'm back in Southern California. Right outside of Riverside. 600 and I don't know how many miles. What I'm gonna try to do the next time, or in a couple days, I'll make a compound butter to put on a steak using this machine. But oh, I don't know why I put the spatula right. I mean the tongs right here. Yeah, hell. Butter on my shirt, son of a bitch. Maybe time to cook this shrimp up in this sauce. I just did this part so y'all see what I'm doing. Where the hell did I put my lid? There it is, it fell. Sorry. As y'all see, I'm not the best producer of this show, or channel, whatever you want to call it. I do what I can, but I'm going to let this cook, these shrimps cook for the next five, ten minutes, and I'll be back. Hey, right, y'all, I'm screen. back. Somebody come in there hacking. Sorry, I had to pause that real quick. I got to flip these shrimp. Smells delicious in here. They yeah, gotta flip them one by one, so be patient. Yeah, how exhausted I am. 
But I know y'all love me and I love y'all, so I'll be back. All right, y'all, I'm back. Just watch some Ink Master and cooking dinner. Dinner is done. I'm ready for bed. So what I'm gonna do is better scoop this rice into this bowl and do what I gotta do. I need to go to bed. If y'all don't know, y'all don't know. And for the people that think, oh, you're just a truck driver, yeah, I'm a truck driver. But you try driving 600 and plus miles a day. And you'll see how tired we are. I know people that ride in airplanes and are jet lagged. I don't know what the hell a jet lag is. When I get out of a plane from being on the road, I feel refreshed because I didn't have to do the driving my personal opinion if you're a truck driver let me know what y'all think I'm just putting the rice in here hold on I'm hungry so what I'm gonna do is round this off this is just the jasmine rice that I always use y'all know if y'all have any parts to do with my channel you know I use jasmine rice. I don't use just regular rice. There we go. Put that there. And then here's the scrimp. The scrimps. smells so good. I gotta grab tongs for this. I just want to say I know we just passed one of my other favorite artists death anniversary out of Chicago FBG death we passed him a couple a couple months ago to me he was the best artist out of Chicago other than young pappy young pappy is a different level but young pappy FBG duck and of course, their rival, their op, as you want to call it, King Von, his death date is coming up soon. And Asia Doll, you can go somewhere. I'm trying to be nice. But yeah, this is my dinner tonight. So you guys, I know I'm exhausted, but still made time to make a video tonight. I'm just scooping up the sauce. There we go. And then, touch it off. Where'd my parsley go? Found it. Ready for this? This is what we made today, but hey y'all. This is Trucker's Life. We uh